know Pookie just is the life. No, Pookie. He doesn't know that I'm living here. But that gives a little bit of suspense and romance to our love life. Pookie, just enjoy the weather. It's so nice out. But something is missing. Every time I try to get with him, something always gets in the way. We have to find his weakness. I know I've been living here for a month and I could have figured out what his weakness was, but I was just relaxing and the baby needed some rest too. <gasps> Pookie, you're right! He does have a monkey! I can get that and make him sad and then he'll fall in love with me. <laughs> Pookie, I am not going to give you $20 for that advice. Um, girl, what is wrong with you? I, 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 uh, what? I'm just trying to find some ice cream in here, Phantom. I'm hungry. Uh, oh, for a minute there, I thought I was talking to a wildebeest. Bestie, there's plenty of ice cream. Relax. I'm sorry, Phantom, but I really need ice cream and haven't had any today. Uh, mmm, this is so good. It hits the spot. So, Bestie, how are things going with you and Chance? Chance the bodyguard? I mean, he's okay. You know, I ended up kind of like thinking that he's cute and all, but like, he totally flanked me. He was just like, oh, well, I have to go now. I have to follow protocol. Boy, you were all over me. Just remember that. But whatever. Um, nothing at the moment. Ooh, sounds like he likes you, Phantom, but he's like playing hard to get. Ugh, hard to get is not my style. I, I don't really have time to be chasing up there anybody. But I mean, at least it's nice, you know? Maybe, maybe we'll see what happens. But at the moment, I'm just, I'm just chilling. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, but if you have anything else to say, you know you can tell your bestie. Yeah, I will. Also, how are things with you and uh, that guy? Who, Coffee? Yeah, girl, how are things with you and Coffee? Oh, <clears throat> um, it's been okay. I mean, we were just kind of being friends, and I don't know. I mean, I still think he's cute, but I'm just trying to take it slow, you know? I'm not trying to rush it into anything, because I'm not desperate. Sometimes you can be, but yes, that's true. That's awesome. I'm happy for you. <gasps> Phantom, how can you say that about me? Girl, I love you, but sometimes it's true, you know? Sometimes you just be, like, all over, you know, coffee, and then one day, and then the next day, you're just kind of like, you know what? I'm not in the mood for it. Well, yeah, because you can never be too careful with boys. I agree. Boys can be a little crusty mushy, if you know what I mean. But anyways, um, I need to go check on Mr. Monkey. I put him in the laundry. Oh, yeah. That's your favorite monkey that you talk to in your head all the time, like a normal person. I'm not crazy. <laughs> Come back, Mr. Monkey. He's probably squeaky clean. Okay, Pookie, it's time to go get Mr. Monkey from the laundry match and steal him from Phantom. <coughs> Don't worry, Pookie, I have my ways of stealing Mr. Monkey. <coughs> Shut up, Pookie. Anyone who gets in the way of me and my love is an enemy of mine. Come on, let's go. All right, Bestie, we gotta go to the laundromat and pick up my clothes anyways, and we gotta pick up Mr. Monkey! Okay, well, hopefully someone didn't steal them because people have been stealing clothes from the laundromat. Oh my god, girl, no. There are people that watch that stuff. Oh my Jesus. If I left my laundry unattended, I would go crazy. But no, it, it's it's fine. I already paid somebody to make sure to look out for it. Alrighty, let's go, Bestie. Okay, let's go. Make sure to keep your hands and feet in the vehicle. Yay, let's go! Oh man, oh man. This guy had a lot of clothes. Ugh, but I think I'm done. Let me just put it down. Oh my god, how many stuff does this guy have? And his silly monkey, jeez. Oh, who's that? She looks like a hot babe. <laughs> Better introduce myself. Hello there, Mish. Welcome. Welcome to the laundromat. How, how, how can I help you? 
Oh, yes. Um, hello there. My name is Mrs. Phantom Max, and I'm here to pick up my husband's clothes. Your husband's clothes? Well, that's unfortunate. A beautiful lady like you should not be married. You should be with a guy like me. You do not tell me what to do, so get out of my way before I report you to the authorities. Man, I like them feisty. Well, I mean, I I'll, I'll let you the bags, but you just gotta give me, you know, a form of ID just to confirm that you are who you say you are, you know? How dare you? First you flirt with me, and then you ask me for identification? I need to speak to your manager so I could report you to them, and then you can get fired. Ugh, you are the love of my life. It is unfortunate that you are with somebody else. Go on, my lady. Get your bags of your stupid, stinky husband. I shall move out of the way. Yes, thank you so much. And since you care about me so much, why don't you go and get me a snack for me and my puppy, Pookie? Anything for you, my lady. Perfect. What an idiot. Nope, Pookie. I am not a liar. I am married to Phantom, and I'm here to pick up his clothes. Uh, oh, I mean, you're right. His monkey. Oh, look at this cute little monkey. Play with the monkey. Play with the monkey. I should probably burn this thing. Pookie, why do you always have to have morals? Okay, I won't burn it yet. <coughs> oh, you're right. We need to run before they get here. Let's go, Pookie. My lady, I got the food. Uh-oh. Well, this doesn't look good. <laughs> she also took the guy's clothes as well. <laughs> I'm probably gonna get fired. Hello, hi, we are here to pick up Mr. Monkey and my clothes. Well, hello, sir, welcome back. Um, So, uh, you see, uh, um. Yeah, what, what, where are my clothes? Where's Mr. Monkey? Yeah, uh, Mr. Monkey and your clothes are gone. Um, some, uh, someone took it. Oh, it was the most beautiful woman I've seen. The most beautiful woman? Who was she? Did she say who she was? She said that she was Mrs. Phantom Max. Oh, it's unfortunate. She was a beautiful woman. Mrs. Phantom Max? I'm not married to- Oh my god. Phantom, it's Gretchen. I literally see her on my tracker here. She's leaving and she has your clothes. No, anything but Mr. Monkey! <laughs> Tell me one reason why I shouldn't pull the trigger. Oh my gosh, Phantom, put the gun away. It's okay, sir. You can go ahead and shoot me. I am in love. Being that I saw that beautiful woman, I feel like I have my life completed. Did she put like a sleeping pill or love potion on him or something? Phantom, probably knowing her, I mean, who would be in love with Gretchen? We should leave him alone. Ugh, fine. You live another day, but the next time you mess with Mr. Monkey when I get him back, it will be your last! Yes, Pookie, our plan worked. We have Mr. Monkey and we have our own place and I get to just relax. Play with the monkey, play with the monkey, play with the monkey, play with the monkey. He, <laughs> he's so soft, I love him. <coughs> no, Pookie, I don't like Mr. Monkey more than I love you. Jeez, you have jealousy issues. <laughs> Why did we lose Gretchen? How did we lose her already? How did she get so smart? I want my Mr. Monkey. Phantom, it's okay. We're going to find Mr. Monkey. And we didn't lose Gretchen. I tr promise you I have her tracked right now. It says that she's nearby. But where? Where is she? I want my monkey and I want him now. I'm sorry, Phantom. It's okay. We're going to get him. Look, it says that she's in your house. In my house? Why the hell would she be in my house? She's not that stupid. You know what? Maybe she is. Yes, here. Follow me, Phantom. She's right up here. 
Oh, okay. Okay, we're almost there. It says she's right in here. <gasps> Phantom, come quick. Play with the monkey. Play with the monkey. Gretchen, what the hell is all of this? What are you doing in my house? Why does my house look like a dumpster? Wretch. Pookie, this is all your fault. If you weren't singing loud, he wouldn't have found us. Ah, ah. Well, it wasn't me, because I sing like an angel. Ah, ah. No, you sing like Kaka. Gretchen, how long have you been living here for? This looks like a mess. Ugh, kitty, why does it matter to you? But if it even matters, I've been living here for a month undetected. <laughs> you know what, to be fair, I don't really check this house because it's so big. So, I mean, she got me there, bestie. Oh my gosh, Phantom, you need to be better about checking your house. Gretchen, get out of my house now before I call the cops. I gave my monkey back. I will give you Mr. Monkey back if you marry me officially. Gretchen, how many times do I have to tell you? I'm not interested in you! Ever! It's okay, my love. You don't have to be shy. You can show off our love. Ah, ah. Quiet, Pookie. If you don't give me back my monkey, I'm gonna make sure that Pookie will never see the day of light ever again. <gasps> you wouldn't do that to him. Pookie is our shine. Um, Phantom, that's a little much. I don't care. No one touches Mr. Monkey. Give me my monkey or Pookie faces the consequences. Okay, okay. Jeez, here you go. Playing with the monkey, playing with the monkey. Ew, I gotta wash him again. He's all sticky. Playing with the monkey, playing with the monkey. <laughs> uh, that is it, Gretchen. I'm gonna put a stop to you once and for all. You know the drill. You can never catch me. <laughs> uh oh. We gotta run, Pookie. Our smoke bomb didn't work. Sayonara! Oh my god, what is she doing? Oh, oh no. Let's go, Pookie. Oh no, Pookie. I honestly don't know how she does it. Yeah, Bestie, she's really committed. Like When she escapes, she makes an escape. But oh man, I have to clean this hot mess! Gretchen! Shut up, Pookie. That's my line. Playing with the monkey, playing with the monkey, playing with the monkey, playing with the monkey. Man, this is such a good house. I'm glad I got to move in here. This is the best house in my life. Isn't that right, Mr. Monkey? Who's a good monkey? You are. Excuse me. Excuse me, this is my house. Let me in. My stupid ex girlfriend sold it. This is not gonna fly with me. Sir, I am not your ex girlfriend. Go and resolve that with her. I bought this house. It's mine. Go away. Oh my goodness, Mr. Monkey. Do you think we should call the cops? We should call the cops. I'm calling the cops. Right, not again. That's the third time this week he's called the cops. I've got a jet. Oh my god, how many times do I have to call the cops? I'll be like, hello, sir, resolve that with your ex-girlfriend. That's not my problem. I bought this house square and fair. No one told you to give her all rights to your home. Like, that's a stupid problem to you, okay? Not my problem. Anyways, it's mine and I love it. <laughs> Ooh, I wonder what Caramel is doing right now. Ooh, I hope Phantom loves this chocolate smoothie I got him. And I don't know who that weird rich man that was running down the driveway was. I'll make sure to let him know about it. Phantom! I said, if you don't stop ringing on that doorbell and knocking the door, I will call the cops! Go! Yeah. But I made you a chocolate smoothie. Wait a minute, that... Crying sounds like, oh my god, it's caramel! Oopsie! 
Oh my god, Bestie, I'm sorry! Wait, I thought you were that weird guy! No, it was me! I just wanted to surprise you with a chocolate shake! Aw, oh, thank you. No, I'm sorry, Bestie. It's just that I had this strange man come in every once in a while, or every day in a while, and always wants his house back. But it's not my fault that the real estate agent owned this house and then sold it to me. That's not my problem. He should just go back to that real estate lady, not me. Oh... Yeah, that makes sense. I just thought you didn't love me anymore. Oh, no, I would never do that. Unless I find me a husband, then maybe. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, in that case, bestie, here's your chocolate shake. Congrats on the new house. Aw, thank you. Even though I don't like chocolate shake, I'll still take it because you made it. Ah, I didn't know you didn't like chocolate shakes. Yeah, I'm sorry, bestie. I actually like vanilla shakes. <sighs> Okay, I'll make a vanilla shake next time. Oh, no, but it's okay. I'll give it to Mr. Monkey. He'll drink it. Um, Mr. Monkey's not real, bestie. <gasps> He's real to me! Don't let her say those things, Mr. Monkey. Okay, um, anyways, um, you want to show me around? I want to come see inside. Oh my god, yes, girl, I'm about to show you this house. It's so nice. You will not believe it. Oh my god, bestie, everything looks so nice and beautiful. <gasps> yes, oh my gosh, this place is huge. Yes, and I got it for a good deal. I got it for 133,000 <gasps> Robux. It was really cheap. Oh my gosh, you did snag a deal. This is amazing. Yeah, the real estate lady was just kind of like, I want to get revenge on my ex-boyfriend because he cheated on me, so I'm going to sell this house super cheap. And I was just like, girl, you're eviler than me. So I was just like, yeah, I like you. I want to be your friend. Actually, she actually has pink hair. Maybe you might get along with her. Just a little bit on the cuckoo side, though. Oh, yeah. Us pink-haired girls tend to be a little crazy. Yes, but honestly, it, it was all worth it. Let me show you what my room looks like. <gasps> yes! You see that, Pookie? That could have been me and Phantom. <coughs> what do you mean if I wasn't crazy and obsessive and a criminal that I would have him? You're crazy, Pookie. I don't believe you. Okay, maybe just a little bit, but I have my reasons. Hmm, I have an idea because they tricked me. I gotta get back at them. <coughs> yes, Kitty is gonna regret ever messing with me. They'll feel the wrath of the real Gretchen today. <coughs> oh, yes, Pookie, I'm hungry as well. Do you want to get something to eat? This is my room! Isn't it nice? <gasps> oh my gosh, this is huge! This is really nice, Phantom. Yes, uh, I know. Look, I have a nice bed next to a big old TV. Look, I can even sit on the couch. Ooh, look at me. I'm laying down. I'm bougie. Ooh, yes. You're living the life. Oh my god, you haven't seen nothing. Look, I have a little fireplace. Isn't that cute? Oh, that is. Oh! That is so nice! Yes! Uh, and then I have a bathroom too. Look at this bathroom. Oh, that's the, the well, this is the closet right here. <gasps> Ooh, a walk in closet? Oh my gosh. Yeah, so where I'm gonna put wow. all my clothes. And look at this mirror. It looks <gasps> so nice. Oh! Wait, where did you go? That is nice. Uh, there's, a, there's a secret room in there is where the safe is. Wait, what? Uh, I didn't even know that. Show me. Let me see. Yeah, right here. The little, look, the little finger thing. Where? Oh, what in the... Oh, excuse me. I did not know this house owned a... Oh, <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, I didn't know this either. Wow, well, at least now we know where the safe is at. So make yeah. sure it's going to be safe. Wow, I didn't even know it had a compartment. Thanks for finding that out. Yeah, it was an accident. Wow, and look at this. I have a nice shower, so I can just, like, you know, take a shower whenever I want to. Oh. La, 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 la. Oh, my gosh. Yes, it's yes. nice. <gasps> this is nice. Oh, my gosh. I'm so jealous, bestie. Yes, uh, everything looks like, oh, my God, you have to see the kitchen. Let me show you the kitchen. Picky, I think I have an idea of how I'm going to get my revenge. 
I'm gonna get them a special picture. If it's not just any picture, a sleepy picture. No, it's not illegal. Especially if you're sending it to a friend. I know Kitty isn't my friend. I was talking about Phantom. Yes, she is still my husband. Thank you for clarifying. Let's go, Pookie. Yes, the kitchen is so big and it's so beautiful. Oh my god, wow. I love it here. Yeah. Yeah. This is so cool. Yeah, it's like one of my favorite places besides food. I'm gonna love it here so much. I'm gonna love cooking here too. Oh my god, we're gonna have like really big parties. Yes, definitely. I can see that happening for sure. Yes, even though I'm kind of anti-social, but that's okay. We'll work on that. We'll we'll really work on that. Yeah, slowly but surely. Yeah. Huh? Were you expecting company? No, not really. Unless it's that guy again and he's back being so annoying. Sir! Can you please stop coming here? I'm really gonna call the cops. Uh. What the heck? Like, does he not listen? You know what, Bestie? Come with me because I'm about to go downstairs and we're about to tell him off together. Yeah, that's weird. Some people just don't get a clue. Yeah, let's go check and see what the heck this is about. Um, hello! You need to... What the hell? Is that a pizza box? Someone <gasps> order pizza? Oh, Phantom, that's so nice of you to order us pizza. Girl, I didn't order any pizza. Oh, look, there's a note on it. Mm -hmm. What does it say? It says, this pizza is for my dearest neighbors. Welcome to the neighborhood. Oh, that is so sweet. Oh, that is sweet. You have some nice neighbors, Phantom. Yeah. Idiots. <laughs> now they're going to feel the wrath of the real Gretchen. Keep falling for the tramp. Phantom, let's take it upstairs and eat it. I'm hungry. Yeah. Yeah, I'm super duper happy. Let's go take it upstairs. Mmm, don't mind if I do. Oh my god, Bessie, this is so delicious. Who wouldn't want to eat this pizza? So delicious. It's so delicious. Yes, I'm gonna eat like three of these. Girl, I already ate four of these. Well, this was really good. I think I had enough pizza, but I, I don't know why I feel. A little sleepy. <gasps> Phantom! What happened? Wait, I'm feeling sleepy too. Oh, oh look, look at that. I just walked in on a little slumber party. Time to take back what's mine. Come with me, my love. I'm going to take you far, far away from here to a romantic spot and to teach you a lesson not to mess with Gretchen. And Kitty, you're fine on the floor for now. Huh? Wait, why am I sleeping? What's going on, Phantom? Phantom! Wait! Where's Phantom? No, I'm actually getting scared now. Where is he? And what is in this pizza? <gasps> oh my gosh, what is this? Is this sleeping medicine on the pizza? How did we not notice this before? And is this dog hair? <gasps> this is Pookie's hair. I think I know who's up to this. Hmm, I don't see Gretchen on the radar. I think she might have deactivated it. She's becoming smarter each time. Maybe I can see if somebody has seen her. I'll go take a look outside. I'll come find you, Phantom! Hmm, I wonder if this person knows where Gretchen is. She shouldn't have gone too far. Hi, welcome to the hair salon and stuff where you can get your hair done, but we can't promise you your life. How can I help you today? Um, well, I was hoping you can help me. Um, did you, have you by chance seen, like, a pregnant woman with, like, a puppy maybe carrying, like, um, an unconscious man in her shoulders or something? A pregnant woman? <gasps> oh my god, are you talking about Gretchen? I hate that ass 
asquerosa. She always be getting on my nerves. I do not like her. She be thinking she a baddie and she a 10, but really she's a one. I hate her. Oh, oh my God. Why do you hate her so much? I mean, we all do too, but not that bad. What did she do to you? Oh, what did she do to me? She stole my man. She stole 10 of my mans. Like, who does she think she is? She thinks she's such a baddie. I cannot stand her. So you know what, miss? I'm sorry. I can't help you. If I could find her, trust me, I would have put my hands on that woman, but I cannot help you. Oh, okay. I understand. Um, sorry about her taking your 10 mans. Um, I'm just gonna go. Bye. Mm-hmm. She cute too, but she's not better than me. Especially that Mason and Bella. They need to get together soon so that I can have my blue-eyed babies. <laughs> Hi, I need help, please. Oh, hello, ma'am. Do you have an appointment? Um, no, but I have. I was just. I just have a quick question to ask. Is that question about an appointment? Um, no. Then I do not care. You can leave. Goodbye. Bye bye. No, but it involves my friend. He was kidnapped by a pregnant woman. Her name is Gretchen, and she's got a dog. Ah, uh, you know that barbarian woman. How dare you mention that name? She is not allowed here, ever! Oh my god, what is she doing here? She brought her disgusting dog into the sauna, and on top of that, she thought it was fine for her to come back and never pay. My people are looking for her. I do not know what kind of magic trick she uses to stay away from my people, but I will come and find her. So, if you have any questions regarding Gretchen, just let her know that she will probably not be alive for the next 24 hours if I find her. Oh, um, on second thought, never mind. Uh, talk to you later. Hmm, she looked like she knew something about that woman. Ah, it doesn't matter. I do not care. But if I do see her myself, I will take care of that barbarian woman and that stupid dog, Pookie. Ugh, since when did Gretchen know how to outsmart me? And where would she even go? Ugh, this is useless. Wait a minute, what's that over there? There's hair tracks here. This is Pookie's hair. Let me follow the trail. Uh, where am I? Ah! What is this place? Gretchen, not again! Hello, my love. I'm glad that you're awake. I'm so glad that you love the pics I made you earlier. Hey, Pookie, I'm talking, not you. Oh my god, Gretchen, I think you're taking it too far. Like, you put poison in the pizza just to capture me? Are you insane? Insane? No. Delusional? Maybe. But I will make you pay for making me look stupid the other day. <laughs> Science! I am very angry. Oh my god, Gretchen, you're scared! You sound like a psychopath! Well, you made me into this. I've been very lenient with you lately, but you and Kitty have been pushing my buttons, and I don't like being made look stupid. Oh my god, Gretchen, I think you need to calm down! And I think you need to shut up and let me do the talking. Oh my god, Gretchen, I've never seen you talk to me like that before. Oh, do you like it? Yeah, I think I might have gone a little too far, Pookie. But I was very angry. Oh my god, now I know not to make Gretchen angry or she turns into a weird monster. Not so fast, Gretchen. Well, well, well. If it isn't my dumb cousin, Kitty, I knew you would be dumb enough to come follow me. Aww, dear cousin, do you underestimate me that much? Yes, yes I do, actually. Well, then I guess you wouldn't mind if I brought this person with me. Well, 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 if it isn't my favorite client, the fat woman with the disgusting rat pookie, I found you! Uh-oh, pookie. I think we're really in trouble this time. 
So, Miss Fat Woman, are you going to pay me my $5,000 or not? Because I am ready to come and hunt you down. You cannot escape me this time. Anastasia will come for you. You may have won this fight, kitty, but I will win the next one. I promise you that. She do that. Ugh, great. Fat woman learns how to be secret agent. This is going to be a problem. Ah, whatever. I will go ahead and find her more. Thank you for letting me know, Miss uh, uh, Kitty Cat. I will pay you my respects. Bestie, help me! <laughs> <gasps> oh no, let me untie this. I'm uh, sorry, Phantom. Oh my God, it was scary. Gretchen turned into a really creepy girl. She was just like, I'm gonna go and get you. Like, she was like the exorcist or something. I don't think we should, like, really make her really angry. She's really weird. Yeah, I forget that when she gets mad, she gets very psychotic. I'm sorry, Phantom. We need to really do something about Gretchen because she's getting a little bit out of control getting into my house like that. Yeah, yeah, she's a little unhinged. I don't know. Maybe we can talk about it later. Ugh, whatever. One thing's for sure is we're not ever gonna eat pizza from a neighbor ever again. Yeah, that's for sure. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember to not trick me. Why does Phantom have a lot of e-boys in his computer? What the heck? And why do they have so many abs? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What the heck? I wanna be like them. <laughs> They're so strong. I wonder what they have to eat. Cause I'm so hungry. My stomach sounds like my farts. <laughs> Uh, what a wonderful Saturday to spend my day with. I hope Nap isn't like doing anything weird. I don't know why I trusted him with my computer. He said that he had to look for something and I just gave him my computer. Ugh, whatever. It doesn't really matter to me. I'm just relaxing and I don't have to hear from him for another hour. Yes! And I love watching my favorite show, Survivor. That's how I feel every day, surviving Gretchen and stupid people that bother me all the time. <laughs> Ugh, being a witch is so hard. Like, I don't even know why I can't even get any more victims. Like, people are starting to get smarter every day. Stupid computer. It doesn't do anything. <gasps> I have an idea. It is the weekend. Maybe I can, like, find some fool that's, like, hungry or whatever the case may be and put, like, a discount. Like, I don't know, 90% off or something. Maybe that will get me, like, a victim because right now, Gretel is hungry and I need to fatten a victim so that I can become young and beautiful. Oh my god, like, I need to, like, find victims because, like, it's getting that bad to the point where I, as the queen of all witches, need to, like, find someone to become young. I cannot live like this anymore. I need to find a new victim so that I can find me a new sugar daddy and I can just be, like, you know, be together forever. But for now, I need to find an idiot that is willing to fall for my trap. Hmm. Oh, I got it. It is the weekend. Maybe I could put like, you know, like a deal or something. You know, people love to eat all the time. Maybe I could put like 90% off. We'll see which idiot falls for it. Oh my god, I have like the perfect advertisement. I'm gonna put, um, we do handmaids for feet. I think that would be a good one. I don't know. Like, I don't know what these mortals do nowadays, but I'll go ahead and do it anyways. <laughs> Wait, I found something. Free feet? Then food is 90% off? Oh my god, this is gonna be the best place ever. Oh, it's in King Burger. Wait, it, that's close by. I need to go right now. Oh my god, it's been so peaceful. Nap, I hope you're not doing anything that I wouldn't be doing. My god, he's been so quiet. I'm a little worried. Hmm, should I check up on him? Nah. Oh my god, I actually found someone to actually fall for this stupid thing. Oh my god, this is so funny! Okay, good. Now I can finally be a princess for like ever and ever. And all I have to do is trick this mortal into thinking that he's getting free stuff. Ugh. 
What an idiot. All right, time for me to go get ready. Maybe I should hire someone. Hmm, I'll think about it. Well, it's time for me to perform my plan <laughs> at the burger joint. <laughs> what an idiot getting things for free. Please, where do they do that at? Hmm. hmm should I tell Phantom? Mm, I don't think so. Uh, uh, he may eat it all. And I'm feeling a little greedy today. Alright, well, time to go. I'm so hungry. Ah, man, that was a kind of good nap. All right, it's time for me to get a hold of nap. Nap, you've been on my computer for too long. Hmm, that's weird. He's not answering. He probably fell asleep or something. Or maybe he's in the toilet like last time. Let me check. Um, what the hell? Nap, are you in the bathroom again? Don't blow it up. Ugh. Why isn't he answering? Wait a minute, what the hell does that say? It says here you get 90% off and free foot massages at the burger joint. Um, ex what? <laughs> that sounds like scam. Oh my God, he would never fall for. Oh my God, what if he fell for it? <sighs> Nap! <laughs> this is gonna be so easy. I know these mortals, they like to complain about, what do they call them? Karens or whatever the case might be. So this may add a little bit of a little spiciness. Make sure to do your job correct, you rat. I have to turn you into a Karen. I feel like that's what's gonna work. Yes, ma'am. As long as you give me cheese as payment. Ugh, whatever. Just do what you have to do. I'm gonna go to the kitchen and start cooking stuff. Make sure not to fail me. Yes, right away, ma'am. Oh, look. Finally, the victim is coming. Let's get ready. Finally, I am here. I'm so hungry, and I can't wait for that foot massage. It's gonna feel so good. Lately, my feet has been feeling a little cheesy, if you know what I mean. Anyways, let's go. My tummy is calling for food. They don't pay me enough for this. I hate my life. I hate my job. Oh, look, a customer is here. How can I help you? But don't get crazy. Ugh, I'm finally here. I'm here for the offer I got online. The foot massage and the food, 90%. Does it ring the bell? Ugh, this guy looks crusty and musty. Although he smells like cheese, so it's kind of a good thing. Um, did you know I heard all of that? By the way, you didn't acknowledge me in front of you. But it's okay, I'm hungry. I want that deal, please. And my, my feet is hurting. Okay, one jumbo cheeseburger coming up. Make it extra cheesy, just like my feet. I mean, just cheesy. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Ugh, I don't know where I found this rat. She sounds so disgusting. And besides, cheese is so gross. Like, who wants to eat cheese? Anyways, I already put all the stuff and ingredients on here. Hopefully this fool falls for it. And soon I'm gonna take him back to my place so that I can get my immortality. <laughs> Order number one! Order number one is here! Hmm, wait a minute. You look a little suspicious. You're making my toes tingly. Ugh, he's gonna find out that I'm a witch. How do these people act? Oh, right. Sorry, this food is not for you. This is for, uh, someone else. And, um, I hate my job. And working sucks. And minimum wage sucks. Yeah. Oh, never mind. I must have uh, mistaken it. I I'm number one. Can I have the food, please? On the offer, there was like feet massages too. Oh, yeah. The feet massage. That's not here. Um, Just eat your food. And um, yeah, we're just going to get that prepared for you. Okay? Okay. <laughs> Idiot. Awesome! I can't wait! Now give me the food. Oh my god, yes! It's so good! Oh my gosh, this is the best cheese. Like, they they have the best cheese. Oh my gosh! Let me try to drink. Now I can't wait for the foot massage. 
Um, did you like make that burger for him? Like an actual burger? <laughs> oh, actually, yeah, I did. I went to school for it and I'm actually really proud of being on my culinary skills. I mean, yeah, I was supposed to like add something weird, but you know, I kind of felt bad. I mean, I wanted him to like kind of enjoy it. You know what I'm saying? Being that it's his last day of living, you know, I want to make sure that he had like a special time eating it. Also, I put poison, so any minute by now, he should be falling asleep. Oh, wait, I think he's asleep now. <laughs> <laughs> ah, excellent. Okay, it's time for me to go. You, make sure that no one traces me. You know, people could be finding him. So make sure to cover me well, or else I'm gonna turn you back into a rat! Got it? Yes, mistress. Uh, where am I? Oh, I smell food. And... <laughs> What is that smell? First of all, that smell, it's from your feet, you idiot. And secondly, I abducted you. I'm a witch. So therefore, I am going to steal your soul and turn myself young forever and ever and ever. Duh, that is exactly what I'm doing. Like, are you dumb or something? Wait, you just said someone is abducting me? Wait, that means someone wants me. Oh my god! Papa, is that you? Also... Are you gonna massage my feet as you promised? Ugh, ew, as if! No, you idiot! I'm going to kill you! Oh my gosh, I always wanted to be abducted. This is the best day of my life! Woo! Ugh, okay, I think Nap was last here. It says the promotion was right here. Hmm, let me ask this lady, even though she looks like a Karen. Ugh. Um, miss, I was wondering, um, have you seen a strange looking guy that like, looks like a polar bear and he has a panda on his head and he smells like cheese? Why are you screaming? I can hear you loud and clear. Also, your friend got ab abducted by an evil witch. Um, wait, what? Why are you telling me this? If you work for that person, shouldn't you be like, I don't know, keeping that secretive? Yeah, no, they don't pay me enough. They're underground next to the bank. Take care, idiot! Um, first of all, that is so rude. And thank you for letting me know. And secondly, can I speak to your manager? You are so disrespectful. I am the manager. All right, it looks like I'm here. What the hell? Is that a hut in a secret lab? I'm so confused. All right, whatever. Ha! Now you're stuck with me. No one's gonna save you now. Any last words, peasant? So, uh, about that massage. I would like that massage. You know? You idiot! You're not getting a massage! Ugh! Wait a minute. Who the hell are you? I didn't invite you here. Um, excuse me. What's going on here? What are you doing with one of my best friends? Oh, Phantom. Are you here to massage my feet? No, uh, Nap, I'm here to save you from being kidnapped! Or, I guess, footnapped, or whatever you want to call it. No! He's mine! I need him for my immortality! Oh, everyone wants me. Everyone loves me. <laughs> you know what, miss? I, you know what? At this point, I think this might be a misunderstanding. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna go. Ugh, honestly, you know what? I'm just gonna go with you because this guy is giving me a headache. Like, I've never met such an idiot in my whole life. Oh my god, girl, did we just became besties? Oh my god, I think we did became besties. Ew. Girl, if you want a soul, don't worry, I got you. My ex-boyfriend, I don't even talk to him no more. Let me go find him for you and we can all be friends. Eh. Oh my god, uh, yes, uh, let's go. Hmm. It has been a couple days. Is anyone gonna find me and give me a foot massage?